Known issue with running pod install on Apple Silicon Max. I was able to solve this issue by installing um, x86 version of Homebrew, and with the help of that, I installed the 86 version of Ruby locally. Then I still linked and this Homebrew, uh, this Ruby, sorry, um, as my main as my main Ruby interpreter in my path. I added this to my path, uh, this uh, directory. And after, after that, I was able to install the right version of CocoaPods, which stands to be pod itself. And I was able to run pod install because before it was, after, even though you installed and compiled it from the beginning, even though you installed FFI correctly, it seemed to work, but it got stuck when you tried to download something from the internet. And as for now, the only uh, maybe things to mention is you need to create maybe a symlink uh, to run every time with a x86 architecture i created this sim link as well according to this tutorial but this tutorial didn't work for me uh, in total i just uh, used this uh, sim link because it was very useful as from uh, stack overflow which was which piece of information was useful is well i tried all of this it didn't work even if you compile it from the source it doesn't work anyway because it succeed with installing Cocoa Pods and with building it, but it doesn't work anyway. So I installed x86 version of Ruby and 86 version of Cocoa Pods. And with help of that, I was able to run my command. So I installed it locally into my user folder, not globally. So you need to add this to your path as well. So in my case, it will be 266 version, as you see. So I added this to my path. Uh, let me show it to you. Here it is. So here I added it. And I commented, uh, commented out this, uh, my local homebrew, which is compiled to run on ARM architecture, which could conflict with that 80, uh, x86 that's why i need to comment in to comment out this line to be able to build it for x86 and to be able to run it but now i can uncomment again because i don't need a uh, homebrew again like 8x86 homebrew at least i mean i still need homebrew but not that 88 x86 one uh, sorry uh, yeah this kind of conundrum from the from the one hand, you want to run ARM architecture. From the other hand, you cannot run it because there are so many mistakes there. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope it will help you to run your project because I wasn't able to run nor Unity projects, nor Flutter projects without, like, uh, I wasn't able to run it. I was able to run it only in Unity app itself. And the same for Flutter. I was able to run it in Android sim emulator, sorry. And I wasn't able to build it for, for iOS simulator just because of that simple reason. So I hope it will help someone to solve his or her problems with pod install. And thanks for watching. Keep tuned.